Hi everyone, we are continuing with our countdown to the new year. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back as we continue our countdown to the New Year's. So we have another bottle of sparkling wine, champagne to share with you, but I'm going to try to get some unboxings in as well. So we have the December glossy box and I have had this for a while. As you know, my November uh, glossy box was so, so late. I didn't get it until December and then it was like a few days later I got the December box. I just haven't had a chance to open it. So this one did have a QR code again. The last one I had didn't work. It was a really light white on pink or something and it just didn't show up. This one does work. I haven't checked it but uh, so far the people that have been able to scan this in the USA it did not match what the items were that was in the box so we may have to wing it, but again, it's a glossy box. It comes from the UK. If you go month to month, it's $21. If you sign up for the year, it's $18 a month. You get five, usually they are deluxe size samples. Every now and then they throw, they surprise you by putting in some full size items. They say the value is always right around $75. All right, so again, we did get the QR code. It did work. I did pull it up on my phone, so we'll see if it follows along. So again, they always give you that pretty little ribbon that um, it just looks like you are getting a nice gift. And I am going to see these. Yeah, that was a close one. You, yeah, I just managed to cover, cover myself. So anyway, opening up this box. And those are the items that are in here. So let's see how quick it goes. And of course, we have a nice little tin box this month, just kind of like we did last December, too. We had a really nice box. This one is Little Wonders inside. And the inside, like this. All right, so let's pull up my phone, see if this is working. I don't really do this too well but it does show up on my phone so it looks like well let's see i think someone else showed the cell same thing the glow tonic but i don't think it's in here so i don't have that give them la la what is this the lip kit i don't have the lip kit elasticized booster for hair Nope. And the other items that I could have had was a highlighter. I don't see that. Or another highlighter. So we are going to ring it. Alrighty, so the first item that I see here is something that I love. And it's a rose quartz mask. Or rosé. And you know, I love the scent of it. It's just rose. I love the scent of roses. But then it's got the uh, sparkling wine glasses here. So you think that maybe it was supposed to be rosé. But I love using sheet mask. You can tell this is full of serum. I am going to enjoy using that. Next we have this Kenra. A volume dry shampoo. I don't know. You know, I never used to use dry shampoos, but I've kind of gotten in the habit of doing it because I'm trying to get away from washing my hair every day. So something like this just kind of helps refresh you and makes you kind of feel like you're clean, feel like you got clean hair. So I'm going to enjoy using this. And again, I don't know the values of anything here. I'm going to take the word that the value is at least $75. Next, we have this KP soothing lotion Let's see if that so it is a smoothing body lotion with 10 percent AAJ Let's see if that's gonna Let's see if it has a safety seal it might be if the whole thing is in plastic because I can't okay I got it. it was like holy mackerel I'm getting weak 
just want to see what it's like. So it's a nice thick lotion here. Don't really smell anything. So that's okay, but it feels nice. The next item that we have here is by FEO Skin. It's a lip serum. So I don't know if this has a color or not. We'll see. Try to squeeze it up, see what comes out. Okay, we'll put a little bit right there. I don't know if that's going to show up, but that's the color right there. Kind of just kind of looks like one of my freckles, right? Well, some people might call them freckles. Some people might call them age spots. I'm going to call it a freckle, but it has got a nice gloss right there. I don't know if that's going to show up on camera, but it does have a nice little gloss. So I am going to enjoy using that. And the last item in here is from Earth Harbor. And it is a glow juice and it's a enzyme mask. And... I love using mask. I actually masked the last few days. It's been kind of hard because I don't want to put a sheet mask on because I'm cold. But I've been doing it anyway. So this is what this looks like. It looks like a gel. Let's see if it has a scent or anything to it. It is like a gel in here. It's got a just a nice clean scent. Which is nice if you're putting something on your face. Sometimes you really don't want anything heavy. So anyway, I'm thinking this is probably a full-size item. And Earth Harbor is usually pretty expensive. And inside the box, we've got all these kind of pink foozies. So we got the Earth Harbor, the enzyme mask. We have the Kenra, the volumizing dry shampoo. We got this Evio Skin, this lip balm, lip serum that should feel really nice on. We have the KP Smoothing Skin Lotion, Body Lotion. So I'm thinking this is a deluxe sample. This would be a sample. This is probably full size. And a sheet mask, a rose or rose sheet mask. So, again, I do like everything that's in this box. It's just weird um, getting used to these QR codes. And maybe maybe that was what was in the UK boxes this year. And they just didn't separate the uh, things. So, we'll have to see how that works out. I know sometimes when I could go on their site, you could get some sneak peeks and things like that to see what was in there. But I didn't this time because I had the QR code. So that was everything in my box. Again, I did sign up for the year, so my box cost $18. So I think that's a really fun value. And so let's get on with the Vlogmas. So this is my other Nutcracker that I have for New Year's. This one is from 2006. I am pretty sure this one is from Bombay Company. So we're sitting on a clock and we have Santa with a baby New Year. And he's got his champagne, the baby's got curly hair, and his top hat. It is a music box. You would think it would play Old Lang Syne. I have no idea what it plays. And again, I did get it from, well, it says it's Old Lang Syne, but it doesn't sound like it to me. This one is dated 2006. And again, I know I would have got this one from Bombay. And yeah, so those are the only two New Year's nutcrackers that I have so we'll have to see what we if we just leave it there or bring something else out to show the wine the sparkling wine aka champagne is um, maybe Vacadoga it's a Prosecco and it's from Italy all right so let's see the last one we had yesterday was a twist off so let's see if this is a twist so this is going to be another twist off so i won't struggle trying to pull it off but i'll show you the outfit of the day before we open that so this is from one of my hats um my little kentucky derby type hats that i wear during my wine diaries and most of the hats come with like a little floral thing that you can take off and just wear as a fascinator the earrings probably aren't going to show up too much these are like a rose gold some crystals in it from kate spade that i actually got from one of my stitch fix boxes um, 
that is a ring from uh, Amazon. This dress I got from Penny's last year when they were doing some fantastic sales. I think I got this for $15 and I've just been waiting for a chance to wear it. So it's like a nice burgundy. It's got sparkles on it. It's elastic waist right here. And it's got like all these little tears that go down. It goes just about to my knee. It is fully lined. It's got a little elasticized or maybe it's smocking right here. It's got some two buttons in the back, but because it's so stretchy, you don't have to worry about it. Yeah, just right over the head. And uh, this, I think I got this from Balzano. Now, I didn't get too many handbags from Balzano because it just, it just wasn't my style, but I did like some of the extras. So this was in one of the Balzano's bags for the extras. And it just, I just thought it went nice with the dress. This one is Swarovski. So I've got some Swarovski crystals here. It's gray and then it's like a kind of Aurora type sparkles on it. Alrighty, so let's do the wine. Alrighty. There we go. And my flute here is from Vino. So it says, hello, pretty. And it's got these bubbles on it, little tint to it. Have I mentioned lately that hashtag Nancy would really like to PR for Lino. So if you know anyone that works at Bino or has any clout, pass my name along, please. Alrighty. So there you go. So happy second day of the countdown to New Year's. Thank you guys so much for stopping in and spending time with me. Take care, everyone. Be safe, be kind, be happy enjoy life. Have some fun. Cheers, everyone. Mm. I just love champagne. Well, they're going to call it sparkling wine because it's not from the champagne region of France. To me, it's still champagne. So anyway, thank you guys so much. Love you guys. Thank you for stopping in. And we will see you guys tomorrow when we do continue our countdown to the New Year's.